Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Web Dev. In this video, we will see how we can parse the XML data in the JavaScript. So this is also one of the important thing before proceeding to the Ajax thing. Just I want to have uh, why I am telling these all the things is in order to have a solid understanding or also solid fundamentals thing. So so that we can have these all things. So let's try to do. So let's try to parse this XML data. So here I am removing this one all. So here I can have one div and I will be having animal. I will be taking span id is equal to type. So here you will be having span id is equal to type. In this span I will add it and also the sound. So what is the sound and here I can have the sound. So that's it. Now here I want to update the type and also type is dog and also woof in this span so that that means what i need to do i need to parse the xml file and i need to show it you try to see here animal is dog and sound is woof i need to update it from the xml by taking the data from the xml so let's go to the script tag script tag and here script tag instead of uh, taking so i am copying this one and i adding it this one as a text animal xml data so here i will be taking this one all so why I'm taking like this is normally we will take it from the third party websites and all the things right now I'm taking this one as a text as a string. So here I will be doing animal XML data. Let animal is equal to. So we will do new DOM parser. So I am taking the new DOM parser. So this is available in the window. If you try to see here in our window. I press a in window and if you try to check here somewhere it will be available in dom parser right so top it will be available I didn't remember exactly where it will be so it will be available in the window uh, dom parser yeah here it is available dom parser if i search here dom parser so this is the dom parser and in this prototype, you will be able to see only there is one method available parse from string. So it will be parsing the DOM uh, from the string. Let's go here, new DOM parser. And, <clears throat> and you have seen it, right? Animal parser. We'll try to take it. Yeah. And here, what I, mean, what I can do? Animal XML parse xml is equal to and what i need to do here animal parser dot parse from string we have this one right or otherwise what i can do instead of having animal parser we can take xml parser so this is the xml parser animal xml data okay so this one animal xml and here parse from string first we need to pass the xml data so here we have animal xml data and the second format the second is we need to tell the type of that one so that is nothing but mime type so let's tell the mime type text slash xml so this one is a text as xml now let's print the console.log animal xml so if you try to see the output for this one so this is the document and here you'll be able to see uh, that text what we are having the animal xml document so this text this string data is converted into the documentary so documentary now what i can do here so if you want to get the uh, you got this xml documentary right so here i want to get animal data so here i can do so this one is also let and here i can do let animal data is equal to animal xml animal xml dot get elements by tag name so i can use these all the things i want to get the animal so i can get the animal so this is the tag name so this tag name i am trying to use it so here if you try to console.log animal data animal data so let's see what will happen if you try to see here we are able to get an html collection right now we have only one animal so that is one animal tag so that is the reason we are getting only the one html collection so here we got one html collection so let's try to take it off zero so we have only one thing so just i am uh, i am trying to show you the demo so that is the reason i am taking the zero or otherwise you can loop over each one by one and you can do it so off zero so here i want to get let uh, <clears throat> what i can do so here 
if you want to get one by one so type and sounds so here you want if i want to get type and sounds what you need to do console.log so you need to do animal data dot children so children these are children right so you can get the children now if you see the output this one children you will be able to get type and sounds in in return they, these are again nodes so what i can do here so here let animal name is equal to animal data dot children dot children of zero first one dot text content so i can get the text content so if you try to do the console dot log animal name so what will happen if it see output see i am able to get the dog in the same scenario i want to get the sound let animal sound is equal to animal data dot children of zero of zero so wrong right yeah of zero and here dot text content so i can get the dot text content so here we can able to get this one also if you see this animal sound so if you see this animal name and animal sound we are able to get dog and oh why this one is coming so we need to take this one as one then we will get the second tab so yeah so now i need i need to show it in this one html so what i can do so we have an id and what i can do is document dot document dot get element by id of type i will take the type type dot text content is equal to animal name so i can use this animal name and the second one is document dot get element by id of sound sound right sound is equal dot text content is equal to animal sound so this is how we can parse it i think hopefully we can able to get the output i think so if you try to see here see i'm able to get the dog and also the sound is poof so this is how we can parse it so what i what i have did here so we have parsed the xml so we have did the parse the xml data so which is available in the string normally we can get this all the data from the third party so you can make an ajax call and all those things which will try to see it afterwards so you will get this xml data from the third party websites so from the third party thing and all those things you'll get these all xml data right now we are taking it as a simple example simple string and what i have did here i have did the new dom parser and we have the string so we i am telling that xml parser that to dom parser to convert this one the string to a documentary which is of type text slash xml and afterwards after afterwards unit is converted into a documentary rest of the thing is same so how you will parse the document dom model if you if you see my recent course document object model then you will be able to understand these all things so you will be converted into documentary then you can make use of these all the dom functions like get elements by tag name the children dot child nodes you can also use the child nodes but you will be having a text node these all different types of nodes will be coming so i am taking the children means only that element nodes will be coming so this is how we will be parsing the xml hope you understood about this one if you have any doubts or any suggestions please post the comments below to this video and if you like this video please do support me by subscribing to my channel thank you